Welcome back to the last episode about the cosmic style. In this video, I will show some modern games that would inspire you how to play the cosmic style. So, the first game I want to show is the very famous AlphaGo vs Lee Sedo fight. This is the game which Lee Sedo win. So, people often pay their attention to Lee Sedo's brilliant move. However, I think in this game, AlphaGo showed it a beautiful cosmic style approach before he made the blunder after Lee Sedo played a brilliant move. So let's begin. In this game, AlphaGo is black. So again, very standard stuff in the beginning. So, when black play the attach, white play the harnet, AlphaGo showed a very flexible way to play. He played the dish, showed the hit, and his plan is to bring more friends before escaping this move. Because after escaping this move, there would be a fight in the center. And getting more friends may be beneficial for black's fight. In the real game, Lee Sado captured it and black block. Then black play the double hane, starting to get some center influence. Now black got an influence in the center. He get this influence by pressuring the white group. And now white gets the chance to invade black's territories. White played the escape. Here, AlphaGo showed a very brilliant idea. He played a shoulder hit, a very normal move. But what I want to suggest is after White played this climb, Black played a double honey, a very strong move. If Black extend White played a nice move, then the White could connect together. This is not a good game for black. But AlphaGo prepared a double honey, giving many pressure to both sides. In the real game, black played the ladder. At this moment, Lee Sedo played a losing move according to the latest AI. According to the latest AI, whites need to connect with a solid shape, and black will capture the ladder. Then whites could connect back the weak group. This is still an early game. In the real game, Lee Sedo find out one thing. He find out that this ladder is actually not good for black. So whites could actually escape. Lee Isedo decided to escape, but before the escape, he played the tiger mouth, exchanging with the cornet to protest the cut first. After protesting the cut in center, he escaped this move. Then AlphaGo showed a brilliant sacrifice idea. He played the harnet, allowing the whites to capture all the territories on the right hand side. After the capture and cornet, White played a move to control the four black stones, and then black played a knight move. I think this is a great example of modern cosmic style. Very beautifully creating a large piece of territories by sacrificing these four black stones. If this game is played by modern AI, black already win the game. However, this is the early model of AlphaGo, so there is still bug. After white trying to invade, White played this move. This become a legendary move that helped Lee Sedo to gain a win. In the real game, Black played this retreat. 
I think he overlooked the brilliant moves of Diff Cut. After Diff Cut, there is two defects for Black. The first defect is the cut here, the second defect is the Oyotoshi here. If Black captured this one, White here could play a Hane, and if Black tried to cut off the White Stone, White would hit and cut and extend. Then, these three Black Stones is being captured by the White. But according to AI, actually, when White played this Hane, Black could simply connect, and actually, this is still a winning game for Black, allowing White to escape, but is still winning for black. This cut is the first problem for black. If black connects to prevent the cut here, then the second problem for black is there would be a Oyotoshi. Black could not connect. If black connects, then white could capture it. Black could only start a call. Still, according to AI, actually, this is still a winning position for Black. But the best way for Black to play is actually playing this hit. If Black playing this hit, then actually, there is no move for White to destroy Black's territories, and AlphaGo's Cosmic Style would beautifully win the game. No matter what, I think this is a good example of a modern way to play the Cosmic Style. In the beginning, the corner and edge is a bigger point. But when it comes to the middle game, it is possible to start giving pressure to the white group and develop some influence to the center. And then it's brilliant to play the double Hane in the center to give a huge pressure to the both group in the center and the edge. And after a sacrificing idea, Black developed a huge cosmic style. So this is the first game I want to show. The next game I want to show is played by Kurze and Shin Jin So. It's not exactly cosmic style, but I think it is also a good reference. In this game, Shin Jin So is black and Kurze is white. It's actually the Asian game. So in the beginning, again, very standard stuff. And at this moment, Black played the attack. I want to suggest a thing is that if it's a game in the 1980s or 1970s, it's possible that the professional player would just try to get the territories. And allowing Black to create a very great center and win the game. I didn't say this without clues. I have read many Takemiya Masaki's book, and there are many games that he surrounded the big Moyo in the center and win more than 10 points and sometimes maybe 20 points. Even the opponent is a very famous top player at that time. It's just showing that in that era, even top players could not maintain balance as good as modern players. Surely, White is Kurze, and Kurze would not play slow move like this. In the real game, after the exchange, Black played the Hane, White played the double Hane. Black on it, White played the extension. Do not give Black chance to create a big center moyo. Shin Jin Seo did not start the fight here. Shin Jin Seo played the Hane, and played the attach to destroy White's territories. So this become a game that both sides trying to destroy opponent's territories. This is much more common in modern era. You cannot see one side creating a big moyo and another side just ignore the thing. Usually they will try to invade opponent's territories before the big moyo is being created. 
So, this become a very standard game, but let me finish the game because there is something interesting. It is not a really huge model like Takemi Masaki's big center territories. They still are very large territories. And whites need to invade it. In the real game, white started the invasion. White played this move, trying to invade the black. And this become a very interesting position. This is just some center. And when black tried to destroy white eye shape, white played the attach. Black played the peep. And capture. White played a large knight move. A very interesting real game to make up. At last. Shin Jin Tho killed the white by sacrificing a bulky five. He sacrificed a bulky five, but black played this retreat and white could not make an eye on the edge. White only captured a bulky five. Capturing a bulky five is a death shape, so white is being killed. Kurtis group being killed by a bulky five. A legendary game actually. If you are interested to get this game, you can check out the description. I have the link for the game and you can study it more detailedly. Lastly, I want to show one more game. In this game, black is Sa Chen Kun and white is Se Ke. They are two Chinese professional players. And Se Ke actually is a very well known player in China too. Let's take a look to this game. So in the beginning, again, they are just playing Joseki. After this Joseki, they started to play um very complicated fight around the edge, but Seker played this cornet, and there would be a um, squeeze. Seker noticed this thing, and then he developed an interesting idea. After they finished the fight, Black get the corner and also another big corner. Black secured the two big corner, but now it's white center. White noticed that he could connect this influence with the top left. Let's see how, what he played it. He first played it press and press and press. These are white's power to play. Of course, Black could consider to play a Hane, but if Black really try to play the Hane, this push and cut is very painful for Black. If Black connect, White simply gained this move. This is a very great exchange. And if Black capture, then White could cut. As a result, Black reach it. Then, White play the Hane, and double Hane. They are connecting the center. White finished connecting the influence and creating a very great center model. He developed the idea in the middle game. I think this is the key. Sometimes cosmic style games is possible. 
but you cannot try to play out a cosmic style game from the beginning. At least for the top layer, they would not try to play the cosmic style game from the beginning like Takemiya Masaki. They would start to develop the idea in the middle game. And when Black Crater approached, a beautiful move, and also the best choice according to AI. Shoulder hit. He raided the shoulder hit, trying to surround the territories. And Black Crater the nice move. Here is a complicated fight. Whites need to balance the benefits of the corner and balance the value of surrounding the center. He responded. Because if you're just trying to get the center, allowing black get this honey is too comfortable for black. White played the honey and started the fight. After some exchange, White played a diagonal move, and Black played a band. In the next move, Black could extend and capture the four white stone. It's a logical move, but White played the knight move, focusing the value of the center. Here, Black is not brave enough to capture the four white stones, allowing the White to surround all the territories in the center. So, Black played the knight move, but White played the harnet. In center, forcing the black to escape this group, otherwise white could extend and capture a lot of territories. Then white played the Ahane and reach it. In the next move, white could play the escape and capture this group, so black played the capture. And then white played the blockage, surrounding all the territories in the center. Actually, it's still a close game. White is leading for only around two points, but it's a beautiful game of cosmic style played by Seiko. I think this game really showed that his talent, a uh, great game played by Seiko. So these are the examples of cosmic style in modern era. Cosmic style is a possible approach in some situation, but it's usually not um good approach to play from the beginning of the game. So balance is very important. But among the balance, you can still be more influence oriented. Cosmic style will still be a effective weapon to play in your game. That's all for my sharing. I hope you enjoyed it and learned a lot of ideas about cosmic style. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me and see you in the next video.